Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. Uh, I got requests from the kids tonight. So Heather wanted to cook up some bacon and Eddie had requested pancakes. So I said, well, we will do that. And uh, so I said, well, should I put it on video and show you guys what we got going? I said, why not? We'll throw it on video. So I have a lot of pancake mix in my preps, obviously. Um, now what I'll do too, and I've showed you guys this, this before, when we are done making up the bacon, um, I will take that bacon fat and I save it, I put it in a cup, and we use that like if you want to cook up some potatoes or something to that effect. That's what you do with that. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to pull out the maple syrup that I got from my neighbor. And we'll use that with our pancakes. Eddie, your pancakes are going to be ready here in a second, honey. Eddie? Okay. So now you can see I'm going to pull, I'll pull this up closer here. Nicely golden on the top. So I just kind of want to show you that we utilize the wood stove actually quite a bit. And uh, As soon as I get Eddie's done here, Heather, then you're going to have yours next. Some nice pancakes for Eddie. Bud, come here, honey. We got we got a hovery for you. He's hovering again? Yeah, for him. That's Maxie. Maxie that's what he does. Hold on guys, I'm just cutting up Eddie's pancakes for him. I like to make sure I put my oil in here. Did your flipping go better this time? Yeah, flipping went awesome. Yes, it did. Thank you. Okay. 
That bacon's looking good. Yeah, she is. Now I like my bacon kind of raw, so Same. I don't like it overcooked. Me too. It just tastes better that way. But yeah, we actually we use a wood stove a lot for cooking. Um, it's actually kind of like disappointing when it's summertime and we have to use the uh, gas grill. Mm -hmm. I like having uh, like having the uh, access, you know, with the wood stove. So just cook whatever. Right, just whenever you feel like cooking something. I mean, you can do that with the gas stove too, or gas grill, I guess, too. But it's. Uh, we we'll have to go outside. How about that? Okay, there you go. You don't have to go outside. <laughs> Probably could have cooked these a little longer. No, that one's okay. Do I cook them again? Oh, there we go. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. All right, bring me that other plate. And I'll get that other, that other bacon on there. Bring it over here, honey. Okay, get another piece of paper towel over the top. Please. Now, we will not eat all of this bacon today, just so you guys know. But what we will, we'll cook it all up and then We'll put it in the like fridge and, and, stuff. and we use it for sandwiches or, or whatnot afterwards. But okay, bring your plate. Now I got enough oil. Thank you. You're welcome, honey. I got enough oil in here. So I don't have to add any more oil to make the next ones. And it's two cups of, um, of the pancake mix and then a cup and a half of water. And, uh, it makes quite a few. Yep. Yeah, uh, and there's still enough in here that I could. I'll make a couple more for Eddie because he'll eat a couple more after that. All right. So that's what we do. That's uh, our thing here. But I love using the cast iron. You just kind of wipe it out after you're done. And it really, really works well. This wood stove right now is kicking. We are... Full heat? Huh? We're at full heat? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it is, uh, it is definitely warm. But like I said, I'll take that, that bacon fat and I put it, like I said, right into a cup. And then, we, like I said, if you want to cook up like some potatoes and slice up some potatoes, and cook it on the stove, you use that bacon fat. Perfect for that. And uh, It's weird how the different points on the wood stove, some are warmer than others. Now this like center spot right here, that's the hottest spot on the wood stove. Well I hope you've enjoyed us watching us make our dinner here tonight. 
And uh, I'm going to jump off here because mine will be ready shortly and I'm going to eat them. And like I said, we got this fantastic maple syrup from the neighbor. Alright guys, remember, hug and kiss the ones you love. Tell them every single day. Tomorrow's not guaranteed. Uh, and remember, STD. It's one step at a time, one thing at a time, and one day at a time. Whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're trying to accomplish, you can do it. It's up to you. and No one else can do it except for you. It's, uh, it's the small things like this. That's what makes life worthwhile. It really, truly is. Nice cheap dinner. I mean, the bacon was what it, whatever, whatever cost of that was. But, like, I mean, it's not, not an expensive dinner, and three of us are going to eat in, you know, probably, what, six bucks to make everything? I mean, because the bacon is probably $4 for the, for the pound of bacon or whatever it was. I don't even remember what the price was, but and the pancake mix is cheap. So, all right. I hope everybody has a great day, and I will talk to you all tomorrow. Prepper Nurse One, out for